and he says, I see you out there at midnight painting your lawn and all that, you're out, you're out at all hours of night in freezing weather. And I, I drive by quite uh, this injustice uh, with my husband serves, you know. As I say, it's, it's, it's made me no well and, and when I'm writing letters to, to like Tony Baird, David Cameron and how's the bit like all the police complaints commission, the ombuds men, the ombuds women and you know, I'm just getting past being one to the other here. Police complaints commissioner is actually covering this up. As I say, this whole thing goes back it goes back it goes back years and years and years, you know, uh, to to when I was a kid. If you wanted to track a story back, uh, it goes back to the time of Fumo Fair. If you look at that big dent in my finger there. You see it? Mm -hmm. And that mark, that was Christine Keeler's poodle that bit me in 1959. And, uh, uh, and uh, see, see the paintings, you see me with the tiara on. I've got a great sense of humour because I find it funny that the, 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 the special branch should come into the bars looking for uh, the crown jewels. And what I'd done was I said, that's a great gimmick, I'll put my paintings. So that's, that's my sense of humour coming out if you get me. So what happened was they had me out there, standing uh, out there, at the wall there. It was a different uh, mural. It was on, I change that mural every year out there, as you probably know. If you go on the internet, you'll see that. So what happened was, uh, uh, I'm sitting with the tiara and I'm taking photos, and he said, we'll go inside the house and take some photos, just like you're doing just now. So what happened, I'll get into the bars. I'm, I'm not slabbing the general public, but see, uh, my artwork is a wee bit, it's continental. People buy it in Germany, uh, New Zealand, Switzerland, Amsterdam. He, there used to be a guy came out here from Amsterdam, he used to buy my paints quite a lot, but they was so common with the recession. But if you look, he, you'll see my paintings on Tiger and you'll see them used in Ruffian Hearts, that's Peter Mullen, and they've been using a lot of films over the years with, with the BBC and, and uh, Scottish television, you know. And, they, and they, I got Van Gogh's book, The Yellow Chair. When he was in the asylum, I don't know if you've ever seen that painting. There's a bed in a yellow mm -hmm. chair. It's made a basket wheel, and I painted it over the weekend. And the uh, thing is, see, there's a bang up here. That's starry, starry night. Right. The, what I've done is that. That's my signature. That's me sitting in the chair. That, that's the exact copy. But the only difference is I've got me sitting there and the big one saying, oh, "She's up where, where he used to stay above the the pub." Saying, "Come on up and get your TJ ID." The big nude blonde up there. <laughs> But that's my sense of humour, you know. But what was what was